Today we are going to do the a hind winter traction shoe. This is a traditional Dutch shoe. It's got two heel cocks on it and it's got four stud holes. It's got a Massalot clip, a toe clip. It's fit up for an E6 slim and the fullering is got two nail holes on each side. The heel cocks are in line with the branch and they are just a frazz under one inch, which would give us probably about, I'm gonna say about 20, just under 25 millimeters. I think they're both approximately the same height. This one, the medial is maybe just a frazz shorter. They're just set down. They're not really forged in. There's no cold shut in front of them. It's a good, thick, strong clip. So the, the, the toe is rounded off somewhat, but I think you still have to put some material in there for the toe. The stud holes all have a little bit of chamfer on them. The way the stud holes will be judged is you've got to be able to uh, drop a 5 16 drill bit through the hole, but a 3 8 cannot go through the hole. So all four holes it'll be judged is if they can drop a 5 16 the a drill bit, we'll just cut a drill bit off. It's got to be able to drop through. That's the same size as you would drill and tap for mo most standard drill and tap. The shoe measures just under six inches across, just a, a t maybe five and seven eighths, which would be, which would give us just a little bit of, let's see, 152 across. And then when we have from outside heel, we're just, just going a little bit right around seven. Again, you will get Imperial steel. I'm thinking that this came from Holland, so it's metric steel. And it it was made out of 13 by 25 by 380, which you'll get just a frash short of 15 inches. It's a very, very flat shoe. Very, very clean. I think the test in it will be to try and make all your lumps and bumps be a nice clean section. It's got safing that goes down the edges, but not out the back. Again, this is of Dutch tradition. And if you're on our Facebook or YouTube, these shoes will be displayed, obviously, because you'll be seeing them. Uh, if you have any questions, make sure you let us know, and we'd be more than happy to answer them.